Thanks for logging on to NBA.com as we take you to the capital city of the Golden State, where DeMarcus Cousins was expected to return to the Sacramento lineup, but was a late scratch still battling a virus. Terrence Ross on fire in the first quarter as the Raptors tried to get back into the win column after suffering their first back-to-back -back defeats of the season. Ross, 15 points in the first quarter. He was three for four from three-point land. Then, Ben McLemore. He caught fire in the second quarter for the home team, the Coastal. And then, Carl Landry with the steal off the inbounds. McLemore taking it in. He made the free throw. McLemore had 12 points in the second quarter, and it tied it at 42. At halftime, though, Toronto still in the lead. Second half, Kyle Lowry. Stopping and popping to give the Raptors a six-point advantage. Then the long lob to James Johnson, and Toronto began to pull away with a double-digit lead. Kyle Lowry, once again, hit the fadeaway. Toronto was up by 11, but the Kings tried to rally in the fourth quarter. Derek Williams down the lane to make it an eight-point Toronto game. Rudy Gay for the Kings. Behind the line for three. And it was a six-point Raptor ball game. Then Ben McLemore missed, but Derek Williams was there for the put-back slam. D-Dub rocked it, and it was a four-point Toronto game. But then with the shot clock winding down, Kyle Lowry hit a clutch jumper for the visitors from Canada, and Toronto hangs on for a 117. 109 victory. The Raptors are back in the win column.